Hello everyone, Libby Natomo, and happy holidays, Merry Christmas, it's December 24th. I finally finished all my new decorations, and I'm going to show it off. Got tons of new stuff, and plus, on top of that, this is amazing, big news, I finally was able to get plug from there, an extension cord, and do the plug-in lights down the driveway. And as you can see, I also have my battery ones up. Some of them work better than others. Some of them are like very light and faded. I'm not sure why, but they are. And I'm gonna show everything. I had so many fuse issues this time. I don't know why. I think there was like this one faulty one and it ended up messing it up over and over again. But I fixed that now. And um, so here we have, let me get that out a little bit more the multicolored battery powered and then we have the candy cane lollipop like last year the white battery operated ones they're the like actual lights not the round lights then same thing on this side candy cane and i decided to use one of the lights because it was really dark otherwise over there then I'm going to do this side, go back down and come up. This is the round multicolored lights. These are curtain lights, which I do not like, but they're new and they were a different shape. They were the um, ornament shape, so I thought it'd be cool, but they don't, they're not that bright in my opinion. So I don't think they were such a great buy, but whatever. It still works. <laughs> so that's new. Then plugins. So these are the snowflakes. So it's really neat. I'm just gonna go fairly quickly. Snowflakes. And then we've got the white round ones for battery operated and snowflakes. All right, let me just do this. Then we got more of them over here. So this is kind of what it looks like coming down. There we go. Then I'm going to go back and show the other side. I'm going to do it quick because even though it's only about uh, like 6 or something like that, 6.30, it is really cold. Oh, and then that's my neighbors. They're the only other ones that do like big lights on my street. There's this other house across at this like charity big lights but they were so sort of seizurous like they would give me a seizure if I just looked at them it was like a just blink flash blink flash oh it was crazy I was almost gonna take a video but I decided not to I'm just gonna stick with mine um so here we have Costco icicles I love them so I got more again those darn curtain lights for the snowflakes but I finally figured out what to do with them then got these new little snowflakes. So I kind of over-purchased, I think. And this is what these things look like. Kind of a nice color, huh? And then these are new. These are from Michaels. Really cool. But yet again, they're only the, you know, no plug on that side. It's just the one plug. So I got three of these. But it works. It's cool. I like them enough. And we've got then icicles, candy canes, sets, the, um, these kind of snowflakes and then the hanging warm lights because I wanted to mix match because otherwise it would be too much red. So I needed something to go there. I'll actually have to figure out how to maybe set this up a little bit better for plug-in systems, but it works for now. <laughs> I was trying to figure out for, this is my second time doing Christmas. So, um, I'm usually a Halloween pro. This is my bat cave usually for Halloween, but this is my snow area. So basically I have like snow and candy and like Christmas Wonderland thing going on. Then this reindeer is new, really cool. As you can see, there's so many like roots, so I couldn't actually get those little stand thingies in, in but I, I somehow made it work, so it was cool. These are new, these are stars. So, 
kind of neat. And just kind of a little new, uh, those things too. They got frosted, blue, and warm light. And then it goes to my banner. I love this reindeer banner, it's so cute. Then I have this side, which is a green on the bottom, a red on the top, and pepper lights in between. I'll go a little bit close because I don't know if you can see clearly. So there's the white warm peppermint and there's the red peppermint. So it's like red, white, red, and um, green. Then come in here. So I have a couple extension cords going on. One from the back, because we have hardly any plugging out in the front. One in the back that goes up. So I have from there going up and down the lights. And then, smart thinking from my dad, he thought to use that. Uh, there's like a light like that, but there's a light there. You can use a bulb like plug-in thingy, and it'll have a plug. So I plugged in this. And there's the extension cords, that's cool. Here's some more of these. Then I've got the icicle blue on top there, but they have more blue and white. My neighbors um, have kids and stuff, so they're going outside. Then I have the bells. Yellow lights. Oh, and then I've got these things kind of posted randomly here and there. Those are from last year. Oh, and I put this seal thingy on so that it would be more waterproof. Um, then I have my winter scene from last year. It's the bigger one. It took me forever to mount that up there, but I think it it works. Got this new cute banner. I was always looking for something to fit here. And so I found it. A Christmas tree. Merry Christmas. The other snow banner. Scenes. Oh, I, I don't know if I showed you. Um, actually, now that I think about it, hold on. <laughs> I think I forgot something, so I'm going to go back before I get too much and I have to go out for the balcony anyways so hold on a second there's this uh, these people do these uh, trees in the back they've got palm trees and they light up the palm trees and you can see it see you can see see above like there's the lollipop tree those are the lights so it looks really cool. So I kind of wanted to show that, but I forgot to when I was back there. I mean, you probably saw it when I was coming up, but still. Anyways, now on to my balcony. Last time for Halloween, I made it into the shape of a piece of candy. This time, I don't know if people can guess what the shape of it is. Probably not, because it probably looks different than in person. So there's the green light coming up, and it goes to a point. Red light, point down, coming across. Base of a tree, multicolored light, zigzag, like it's decorating a Christmas tree. So I'm very proud of myself for that, because in person it looks really awesome. This is really hard to do, though. Oh gosh, it's getting really cold, so my nose is a little stuffy. Then we have, continuing on with... Winter Wonderland slash Christmas. And uh, my brother last time, they said it was too much white and blue over here. And, you know, so I finally switched it up a bit. This, so these are the red holly berries. Even though you can't really tell very well. But then we've got sort of like a berry, like berry grass with coming on winter. You know, and then there's... Snowflakes hanging there. I don't know if you can really see. And there's some of the other designs. That is so cool. That one I ended up forming it into the snowflakes into like it's like a little mushroom cap. It looks so cool. Got the reindeer for original reindeer. The hanging star lights. Then we have peppermints. The Halloween 
either trick or treat or jewels or gumdrop, however you want to call them. I have a gingerbread man, candy cane, gingerbread. And then these are new. I had to switch with, this is the area where I originally had the icicle light, but it fused out. So these are the little snowman. And that's the thing. And then there's the bow. Then we've got the sort of Christmassy area with the purple and purple green lights from Halloween. Then we've got the multicolored lights on the lollipop tree. White lights down by the trunk. Two sets of presents. Lollipops. Snowman. And a snowman flag that says um, holiday cheer. Got my peppermint tree, which is the peppermints with the purple lighting to it. Let's see if you can see it or not. It's really hard to tell sometimes the angles on some of this stuff. There we go. Something like that. I don't know. I like it. I think it's cool. And then I loop around and I did the peppermint uh, candy cane tinsel with the tis this season and some Christmas presents. This is the stuff that was supposed to hang above and it's got the, see the seal, but I, that one fell down so I put it there. Then I've got on this side the white candy cane. Let it snow. Let it snow. And these are new, these cute little things. Those, see, this is brand new from last year, like, n never used battery lights, and they obviously don't work. And I just put new batteries in and everything. Well, semi new, I mean, the Halloween light batteries, but still. Then we've got the white going around, and with some blue trick or treat lights to get that sort of candy cane, t candy feel. Up there, we've got the snowflakes and the Jolly Snowman stuff, and I'll show you here. Um, then we've just got, like, the snow. Here's the snowman, the original snowman that I got. So there's that, and then it's, I try to make it even as possible, so, like, blue, blue, and then, you know... So white, red, you know, like white, <laughs> like white, blue there, and white and blue here. So I don't know, I try to make it even. Then there's these. Just got this, but it doesn't really work very well either. And uh, this one broke on me, so I had to glue it back together. Got the Jolly Snowman and Candy Cane stuff. I'll do the inside of my house later. And I, this is my room, and then so I put these here. Cute. These kept fusing out on me, but hopefully that won't happen anymore that I got rid of that bad light. This is so cute. I love the polar bear. So I finally actually made it work, because we've had really rainy, snowy, or not snowy, but like rainy, like almost snowed, it frosted, um, and just winds, horrible winds, so... It's kind of hard to do stuff for outside, so I have to do everything inside. So that's why more of the stuff that you saw probably last year is going to be on the inside. Star lights moving towards where the TARDIS is, because it's got my Doctor Who lights. And there's some of the other snowman stuff. And the snowflakes. And I can't remember if I showed that, but there's that. And then last, I made this, I got the plush and I just wrapped around this sort of uh, extra hangy thingy, I was able to do that. And then I've got this, so cute. So happy holidays, and I think I'm going to end it on the foxes because they're so adorable. Thank you so much for watching this long holiday video.